if we look at our life through the lens of your higher self or a group of higher selves all getting together watching earth seeing what earth is going through and volunteering to come back into earth or maybe they've never been before but coming together as this soul family or star seed as some people like to use the term and agreed to come to earth to help humanity to escape the oppression we've been in but for us to complete this mission and I can speak from personal experience we have to give ourselves building blocks in our lives obstacles to get over obstacles we all work together as higher selves to help each other learn to get to the stage where we can actually do the work we were sent here to do I look back at my life and at the time some very traumatic events happened and especially with relationships but then I look now and I can see I'm a higher self put me in the situation to help me learn and I look back now and I laugh because I can see my higher self sense of humour was actually injected into the situation didn't realise it at the time but looking back afterwards once I'd learnt that lesson it did make me put a big smirk on my face and made me realise that sometimes we're always looking for the grass is greener on the other side of the road without realising that the grass we're actually on is the perfect grass just what we need it may have weeds in it it may have high reeds in it, it may have mud in it but it is exactly the type of grass that we need in part three i'm going to talk about how we can use this knowledge now to our advantage and help us to get over future obstacles quicker <laughs>